Gautama Buddha was born around 563 BCE in current Nepal, which was part of India that time. He was born into a royal family and given the name Siddhartha Gautama. At a young age, Siddhartha was sheltered from the outside world, but eventually he became aware of the sufferings that existed beyond the palace walls. Siddhartha became disillusioned with his life of luxury and decided to renounce his royal privileges to seek enlightenment. He wandered through the forest of northern India, seeking spiritual guidance and practicing various forms of ascetism. One day, while meditating under a Buddha tree, Siddhartha has had a profound experience in which he achieved enlightenment. He became the Buddha, meaning the awakened one, and devoted the rest of his life to teach others about the path of liberation from suffering. The Buddha's teachings are based on four noble truths which are the truth of suffering, the second one the truth of the cause of suffering, third one the truth of the end of suffering, and the fourth one the truth of the path to the end of suffering. Here are some inspiring stories from the life of Gautam Buddha that illustrate his teachings. The story of mustard seed. Once a woman came to Buddha and asked him to bring her son back to life. The Buddha agreed to help her, but he asked her to bring him a mustard seed from home where no one had died. The woman went from house to house, but she couldn't find a home where no one had died. She realized that death is universal human experience and that everyone must face it. This helped her to accept her own son's death and to find solace in the Buddha's teachings. This story illustrates the first noble truth, the truth of suffering. It shows that death is an unavoidable part of life and that accepting this fact can help us find peace and contentment. And the story, the story of Angulimala. Angulimala was a notorious bandit who terrorized the countryside. He wore a necklace made of fingers of his victims and he was feared by everyone. One day he encountered the Buddha who didn't show any fear. Instead the Buddha spoke to Angulimala with compassion and taught him the Dharma. Angulimala was transformed by the Buddha's teachings and became a monk. This story illustrates the power of Buddha's teachings to transform even the most hardened criminals. It also shows that the importance of compassion and non-violence even in the face of danger. The story of elephant. Once the Buddha was walking through a forest, when he came across the elephant, that had badly injured by a hunter. The elephant was in great pain and the Buddha saw that it was suffering. He sat down next to the elephant and comforted with kind words. The elephant calmed down and eventually died in peace. This story illustrates the Buddha's compassion for all living beings regardless of their species or station in life. It also shows the importance of kindness and empathy in alleviating the sufferings of others. And lastly, the story of four horses. Once the Buddha gave a teaching on the four types of people, using the metaphor of four horses pulling a chariot. The first horse represents a person who is easily distracted and and led astray by their desires and attachments. The second horse represents a person who is easily angered and reacts with aggression. The third horse represents a person who is ignorant and lacks understanding. The fourth horse represents a person 
who is mindful and able to control their thoughts and actions. This story illustrates the importance of cultivating mindfulness and self-control in order to overcome the challenges of life. It also shows that each person has the potential to transform themselves and become a better version of themselves. In conclusion, the life and teachings of Gautam Buddha provide valuable insights into the human conditions and offer guidance on how to live a fulfilling and meaningful life. His teachings on the four noble truths and the eightfold path are timeless and can be applied to our lives even today. The stories from his life provide inspiring examples of compassion, wisdom and transformation that can inspire us to become better people. May we all strive to follow the four steps of Buddha and lead lives of compassion, wisdom and virtue. Thank you everybody.